Fellow lovers in a leaf, fellow lovers in a leaf, fellow lovers in a leaf. This is D Love and Wife. Hey guys. Yes, sir. Man, I had a hard week. Long, long week. Extremely long and it was rough. My body hurts. Um, work was not fun, but at least at least I have a job to go to. I guess I, I gotta look at it like that, you know. So, me and the wife came out here. We're smoking on this uh, Double Corona Opus X. This little treat at the end of a, 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 a week when you put it in, put in that work. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> you gotta do that for yourself. Oh, yeah. Keep you motivated. Exactly. <laughs> so, let me hit the cigar one time. Mm. Dry box your cigars. Um, so I was trying to debate on the video that I wanted to make and kind of brought me to this. Most people buy these really expensive lighters. Now this one isn't too expensive. I think this one was about 40 bucks when I first got it. Uh, works pretty decently, um, but I've I've paid for lighters that are like the vectors that are the whole touch touch screen. You hold the button down, it pops up, releases gas, it, it um, sends a spark and it ignites. It's all pretty it's fancy. You spend about a hundred and something dollars for it. Yeah, let's not do that no more. <laughs> No one should go out there and spend money on expensive lighters. Don't do it. Bix, um, little ones like this, you can do this all day long. If it breaks, you can replace it. Even though even something like this, I wouldn't even tell you to go to, to get, you know? Get you something like that. Get you a little torch, 25 bucks a pop. If it dies, buy another one. Not gonna be any any uh, big deal. This is all you really need. You don't need no Calibri with the the fancy uh, mechanisms to it and stuff like that. Just a nice little torch, and then it goes from torch and there's a little button over here or a little slider over here to soft flame. That's all you really need. Holds a lot of fuel. Um, yeah, it's also pretty. Exactly. I love this thing. Um, I went over to my boy's house, Cigar Lee, and he had something that was similar. Oh, oh, let me get the scar. Ah, yeah. He had something that was similar to that. And I was like, man, what? you don't have any regular lighters? He's like, nah, man, all we use over here is torches. And I was like, you know what? That actually makes sense. They're not that expensive. They work extremely well. They got both your, your torch on it, your soft flame on it. Um, you can toggle it a lot more, holds a lot more fuel so you can go through a bunch of cigars. And if, if there's any smokers out there like me, I can smoke maybe three, four cigars in a day on my days off, you know what I mean? I'm probably gonna get about two or three in the night. Um, so I need something that holds a little bit more uh, fuel than you know, the small boy that I just showed you first off. Oh, let me hit this cigar one more time, one more time. For the one more time. Yes, sir. Uh, here you go, babe. I'll let you do that for a little bit. So, yeah, if you're going to spend money, though, Spend money on your cutter, okay? Not your lighter, but your cutter. I'm not endorsing any brands, I'm not doing that, um, but definitely make sure whatever cutter that you have is a decent cutter. Um, you wanna make sure that you're able to get through that cap smoothly. Um, you don't wanna damage your cigars, especially if you spend some some money on your cigars, you definitely want a higher end cutter. 
Um, so if you're gonna invest, invest in a good cutter. To me, this is a good cutter. Um, like I said, I'm not gonna endorse it. I'm not even gonna tell you what it is. If you know, you know. Um, but definitely invest in a good cutter. And maybe something to be able to purge your lighters so that you can refill your, uh, your lighters relatively uh, smoothly. Get all the air and stuff out of it. But yeah, other than that, man, I just wanted to stop in and say what's up to you guys. It's been a while. I think it's been about one or two weeks. Mm -hmm. we, we've been smoking still. Um, if you want to know what we're smoking more regularly, check us out on Instagram. Like I said, we post regularly on Instagram all the time. Um, here, I kind of show up when I show up. Kind of like the Winter Soldier. I come in, I do some damage, and I leave again. You know what I mean? <laughs> but um, I hope you guys enjoyed your weekend. I had to work during mine, but hopefully you, you got to spend some time with family, a loved one, friends. Um, yeah, get some relaxation time in, get your mind right. And uh, hopefully we can keep this thing moving through the holidays, you know? Keep that those good spirits up. I'm trying to get my spirit up before the holidays, you know? Mm -hmm. Halloween is coming up, so you know VI hay season's coming in. That's right. <laughs> Everybody talking about uh, uh, Opus Opus Fridays, or what, what do they call it, baby? Fuente Day Fridays. Fridays. Yeah, yeah. no, nah, I'm going to have Opus Holiday Halloween season. That's what I'm going to have. <laughs> It's gonna be viaje every day. <laughs> yeah, viaje. Mm -hmm. mm. We always smoke that during Halloween time. Mm -hmm. Sit out, wait for the little kids to come through. Hand out candy. Hand out candy. You know, I already put the Halloween decorations out. Oh yeah. Ah. It's it's secretly it's one of my favorite holidays. You know. Me too. I like I like seeing all the kids dress up. Yeah. It, it kind of reminds me of when I was a kid, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah, I like, I love making the goodie bags too and put all the favorite stuff in there. Oh yeah. And you gotta make sure you get that king size. Oh, we, we, we hand out king size and bouncy balls and stickers and mm -hmm. all types of stuff over here. We even put, yeah. we even put uh, candy in there for the adults. So I mean, yeah, you know. the king size stickers <laughs> and stuff. I know, I know like uh, little kids don't really like Reese's. They like the sugary stuff, you know? So we yeah. always make sure like paydays or Milky Ways are in there for the, for the adults, you know? Mm -hmm. Some for the adults and then stuff for the kids. So mm -hmm. when the parents go through, oh, okay, snatch. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. That ash, dope. Look at that thing. Draw box your cigars. All right. Uh. <laughs> it's a beautiful cigar. It's got a really nice golden raisin note on it. Absolutely. It's um, delicious. It's a good one to start with because it's actually very light. Yeah, this one's lighter than I thought it was going to be. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I agree. Mm -hmm. um, but it's delicious. It, it has like mm -hmm. a little golden raisin note to it's it. It's definitely a it's definitely a good like starter because mm -hmm. it's it's our starter of the day we had smoked all day even though it's the end of the night but mm -hmm. <laughs> it, it would be a really good morning stick for our first stick of the day for sure oh yeah mm -hmm. I'm, I'm working on um i'm already putting together my list for the end of the year for the top 20. Mm -hmm. when it comes to cigars i got some bangers for you guys you guys yeah i don't even think y'all know what's coming mm -hmm. And still kind of young, so we still got a few more mm. things we gotta smoke to see if they are gonna make it. If if you watch me uh, previously, you you know what a few of the scars are, are gonna be on the list. Um, there's some new ones that I haven't smoked on YouTube that's gonna be on the list, but there's there's one that's a sleeper that a lot of people just don't. I haven't seen a review except for one review. And they were like, do you need this cigar? Um, and I, personally, I think that cigar is going to be above a lot of people's heads. Um, it's, I don't think it's for like a, a new smoker. You know what I mean? No, no, definitely not a new smoker. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But that cigar is freaking delicious. It's definitely on the top of the list. One of, one of the cigars is on the top of the list. Mm -hmm. But uh, 
we'll keep you guys uh, uh, notified and, and up to date. And like I said, definitely smoke great cigars. If you can smoke with a loved one, do this, do so, get your mind right, get some relaxation time in. And uh, if, if you can do it, smoke, smoke one of these. Smoke, smoke one of these. That ass, though. <laughs> You'll even be uh, better in your day. <laughs> All right, you guys. D-Love and Wife out. Bye, guys. Yes, sir.